bon, on est peut-être obligé de traverser. I think this is part of the old French concession because of the look at the road and the buildings. I think this stretches um, all the way to the other side. So we'll be walking down this road. According to Wiki Travel, this is the old French concession which is now housing uh, shops and stores. Yeah. The other part is more good looking. The one with the special tiles on the road I think that's a preserved part Just reached the side of 
edge of the Bund. Uh, you could ride a cruise, I think it's 50 yuan. I'm not sure. We're not riding that. We're just gonna take a stroll along this long avenue of lights, as you can see. Okay, off we walk. So we've almost made it halfway, and now we can see that weird building. That one? Yeah, that one. I think we'll get a better view once we get over there. Uh, it's a bit dark over that side, so let's go to this side. This is just wonderful. Um, about half an hour ago, I was at UUN, and mostly there were Chinese, uh, traditional Chinese architecture. And then you walk a couple of blocks until you reach this part of town, and you see all these buildings. I don't know what term you use for them. I'm not familiar, but it's as if you've been transported somewhere in Europe. We still in China. This is the best part of the Bund where you could take pictures. I don't know what that is, but according to the characters that I could recognize, Shanghai people something. It's a monument, and then the that's the skyline. I think we need to go all the way there so that we could see the Jin Mao Tower and the one with the crystal roof better. Yes, those two by the way are a 